What's up StarCraft fans, it is time once again to revisit a prestige. This time, you guys voted to do Archip Commandant Artanis. This is the one where the orbital strikes will spot an undone fanatic, basically the Archon dude. It will deal damage and tank for 15 seconds, and the shield overcharge is now targeted, and it's uh, cheaper. It's cheaper and it's available more often. The downside is that the orbital strike now costs 50, twice as much and Garden Shell is no longer a thing. So, uh, our mass use for this one will be Shield Overcharges again. Garden Shell is no longer a thing. We will have Speed Increases, because my use will be flimsier, so I'll, I'll need to replace them more often, and I want my, the replacements to be better. And finally, we will have, actually, eh, it's fine. We'll finally, finally we'll have Spear of Rune Energy, because I want to use Archon Dudes. My ally, Ezreddit, will be idling as Tukov. Thank you to Legendary Sinner, who is supporting me in the immobilization mate tier. Bean Veteran, Karan Queen, and Darth Lixnix and Shadow Archon, who are supporting me in the Pulse Cannon tier. And thank you to all my supporters and patrons. Looks like we'll instead have Tehran Mazard, who is level 996. That's nice. So, I hope he'll be idling. I didn't quite remember if I told him to idle, but he'll, I'll, I'll try to get him to idle this game. I'll try to solve this as Artanis. Let's see what we get. So for this game, I'll want to have a fast expansion. I'll go look up to my ally and tell him to attack, or rather, attack this spot, that spot. Mobius Corps built a battle station on this platform. Oh, We're no, gonna he, have to okay. dismantle it sector by good, sector. Good, good, good. Allies going there. Good. Send the construct here. I will distract the enemies with this Archon dude. Get these two Archon dudes here. Boom, Archon dudes here. I'll micro the Archon dudes. Just to uh, to attack the construct. Cool. Get in, get in. You'll find there you go. Just to the north of your this will give us a very fast expansion. Also, notice that the construct in the middle will not attack my probe once the uh, the trucks are in destruct phase. So that's, that will allow me to send my probe up here without fear of getting you know zapped by this uh, construct thing. And allow me to go for first. Now it'll take so, uh, the next the phase station. is, I'm gonna go here, to all try and destroy the, the first bonus quickly. Two spare trucks have been prepped for you. Head east and you'll find the sector before okay, I'll, you know it. Uh, I'll just follow my ally's truck. It seems like a good plan. Attack. All right, use that, distract the enemies. All right, first one there. So yeah, the, the key thing is that you have to make sure that the Archon dudes are Shot These on. Are transferring their data so they can build additional weapons okay, elsewhere. Destroy this thing. You have time to escort your truck yeah, to make sure they're, so they're the shot on. A target of opportunity. The. Ooh, nice, nice. Okay, I can let this thing die now. Good, this is good. All right, I'll put down a back here. All right. Enemy is classic mechs. So I want. Kill this thing. You'll want to. You'll want to uh, send that there. Actually, Allied forces are under attack. Pack it. No, not 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 that, not that kind of sacrifice. No choice. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I want to keep our dudes together. Keep them together. I'll go for Immortals and Reavers here. Maybe some Dragagoons. I'll go for... Best speed. Let's get the third one. Also, probably need like Dragagoons first to uh, deflect the first the wave. Targeting your truck's coordinates. Keep an eye also, out. I'll... the first wave will come from this side. Okay. Yeah. So... Yeah, that's where the attack was coming from. Because oh no, he's not gonna idle. Ah, uh, he's not gonna idle. Can you? Ah, uh, can't. Oh. So again, if you if you uh if you click elsewhere on the on the darkness, the uh whatever. If you click on the darkness, the archon dudes or the orbital strikes will no longer spawn. That's kind of just a way. He just wasted three shots. I just wasted three shots. So, whatever. I'll just go forward, try to do what I can. 
So for this prestige, my units will not have garden shells, so they will kind of just die very quickly. Okay. I'll wait for the attack wave to spawn. The, the attack wave that goes to my truck. I'll get Twilight in the Forge. Wait. Yeah, Twilight in the Forge. And then I'll get the like, gateway over here. Looks like Amon's okay. minions have found your truck's location. All right. Expect an attack soon. I'll go over here. Run him over here. Stand right here to beat them all into Yeah, stand right there. Alright. Okay. My team strapped together some new trucks. I return to serve. Hey. Oh. Nice. Nicely done. By my ally. Get this forge upgrade. Okay. It was supposed to be a solo, but <laughs> I guess my ally wants to help. I'm not complaining. The original plan was to solo, but no. You see, if he's gonna help, I'd be mad about that. Let's see. Let's see what there's to see. Uh, let's get a reaver. Or not. We could use the radix. Alright. Okay, ally is gonna destroy this thing. I have your appearance on the way. Looks like cloaked units. We're gonna okay. need some detection out here. Good work. One Send less truck over here. One fewer. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Gotta get this thing. Yeah, get it, get it. All the other dudes retreat. Retreat, retreat, my dudes. Need to live! Okay. The first trucks in place. There you go. First trucks in place. Nice. Right, let's get some reverb grades. We'll get reavers. Might as well finish him off. Sorry, dudes. Nothing against you, but you need to die. Die. Alright, cool. Yeah, so we uh, at 8 minutes in, we already have two objectives done. <laughs> it's pretty nice. I have to say, it's pretty nice. Uh, no. Right no, the objective's down. Now I do. Alright, cool. So I'll want arrived. a bunch of pylons here, not because Focus I'm gonna get supply block, but just so I can have vision for my herbal strikes for defense. It'll be pretty useful. I'm telling you guys, it's gonna be pretty useful. Pretty and useful. Pretty good combo. Okay. Yeah, Reavers are pretty good units. You can see where our Totus hates uh, Proros in StarCraft 1. Reavers are really good. Alright, let's move over here. I'll we'll have Silver Barn ready in like 70 seconds, so let's keep pushing them. Alright. Keep pushing. Okay. And Dragagoons. Well done. The construct's right. down. Bad news, commanders. An attack Allies is pushing here truck. with the uh, I'll need the Texianus. Okay. Do not lose a reaver. Ah, uh, I lost the reaver. That was my one reaver too. Feels bad, man. Oh. A couple of lots to uh Allied forces are under here. attack. Can I shoot this thing? I can aggro some stuff, but I can still shoot it. That's a thing. I'll drop the solo right here. Drop it right there. Alright. Let's get a few more. The enemy is targeting your truck's coordinates. Keep an eye out. Dragon goons and shield everything. Shield both our armies. That's gonna be pretty good. It's a pretty good combo. A wombo combo even. Okay. Where's my Zervator? Look at that. It's pretty good. Alright. Let's get it here. No, don't worry, I got an Observer. Need to scan. No need to scan. Okay. 
Truck over here. The enemy is coming for us. All right, focus is down. Ready your blades. Okay, we're gonna see another chance for the Archon dudes to show their worth. Okay. It's pretty good, guys. It's pretty good. Yeah, so everyone's gonna get out alive. Well, not everyone. Okay. Get another Reaver. For Dragagoons. Alright, we're gonna do the bonus. Alright. Pretty effective. It's pretty bonkers. Both your trucks have arrived. This okay, it's the airbase. We we'll want another solar before we push into there. Otherwise, if, if, if that's down. not an option, we can always just bait out the enemies a few at a time. Just chip away at them. We can't charge into them if we're soloing. Of course, we have an ally, but if we're soloing, we can't charge into it because uh, we don't have garden shell. We can't just yeah attack move into the army. Okay. Cool. I can shave off that liberator. Here we go. Ruckus on the way. There we go. Disable that thing. Cool. Nice. So we will get plus three. Drag your goons. Alright. We will. Oh, actually, I have this thing to push the enemy. Archon dudes. Okay. Okay, snipe off this thing. Okay, the banshees. Yeah, good, good scan with my ally. Okay. I'm calling in the hot period. All right. Bad news, commanders. An attack wave is coming for your truck. Okay, let's go. The enemy moves against us. I think we can we actually just win. I think we can just win. This is why I, I prefer Immortals sometimes. They clump, uh, they're easier to put everything in a single area. So I can cover everything in a single... In a single... Uh, we're not getting attacked, but we, we're just gonna win this game. 15 minutes, not a bad time, I would say. My truck. Ah, there it is. Okay. Yeah? Pretty, uh... Game. Hell yeah. we did it. That was uh, partly because of the Archon dudes that I held for defense. Uh, actually, the opening was really good because we were able to basically get the first... The, we, were get, we were able to get the expansion right away. And also, I was able to pretty much uh, get the first bonus also right away. So it was uh, a pretty good combo. Yeah, let's uh, check out the score screen. I can pull it up. There it is. So... Duskwings had the most kills from my ally with 120 kills. He was not using a prestige. That means just he used the, the top bar five times. So he got a ton of value out of that. Dragoon was the most effective for me. I made 20 Dragoons. Only 20 Dragoons. Lost three. That's pretty effective. 85% survival rate. Not bad. And they had almost a 5 to 1 kill ratio. Check this out, guys. Archon dudes had 45 kills. That's pretty good. For a, for a temporary unit, that's pretty good. And of course, top bar dealt 93, or yeah, had 93 kills as well. Pretty, it's pretty effective, I would say. Yeah, the most impactful thing that my Archons were able to do is, I didn't need to split my army. I can just have everything in a big control group, and push forward where I need to push. And I can just have the Archon do for defense. Because normally, the Orbital Strike wouldn't be able to defeat the waves on their own. But with the Archon dude spawning, they can clear the waves, they can get a really fast expansion, they can they get the really fast bonus, and uh, yeah, they can help burst into that base. Remember the last base, I used the, Agar the Archon dudes to burst in and tank damage while the, the rest of my main army moved in alongside my ally. Uh, that is a benefit because the units that would normally be attacking your army is attacking some Archon dudes that are temporary. So you can move in, uh, just chunk away at the enemy and uh, yeah, end the game before the attack waves are doing too much damage to your base. And yeah, if you guys want to see uh, a prestige get revisited, check out the uh, the playlist. It's called uh, I think Commander Prestigious or something. 
And if it's not yet there, you can recommend it in my community post uh, that's going up right now. You can recommend a prestige you want to revisit. If you get the most votes, I will do that next week. I will see you guys next time.